What's up, boys and girls? This is Scyther4077, and welcome back to Wolfenstein 2, the New Colossus. We are at part 9. There's a lot of stuff to explore here on the farm. I'll let you go ahead and do that. There's quite a bit of cutscenes in this uh, video here, but um, there's some action too, so don't worry. I'll be, I'll be running my trap once that comes up. So enjoy for now. I'll be back. Tell you a secret. Okay. Promise not to tell anyone. Yeah, okay. I'll whisper it. There somewhere, Billy. Inclined to this day. Now, the way I see it, we got two options. Either I pay good money for a new pocket watch, or you go down the well in the woods. What's the goddamn ruckus? What the hell is wrong with you? You let them take your property, they're gonna walk all over you till there's nothing left. Now, I gave you that pocket knife. It was in your care. It's your responsibility. I will speak to their parents. You will do no such thing, Sophia. Oh, you're gonna let your mommy fight your battles for you, are you, boy? Now, you go on out there and take back what's yours, and you are not setting foot in this house again until you do. Son, I have tried reasoning with you. I've tried smacking sense into you till the cows come home and nothing is working. Every night you wake me up with these noises. No matter how many times I try to tell you there are no monsters in our basement. I'm sorry, Daddy. At night, I see them. Clear as daylight. I'm coming to kill Mama. All right, here's what we're gonna do. You take this. Wow. And you and I are going down into the basement 
and any monsters that show up, we shoot them dead right between their eyes. Sometimes the best way to fix a problem is to face it head on. You with me? Yes, Dad. Sophia, you in on this? You see them? No, Daddy. The monsters are gone. Well, I reckon if you do no wrong, ain't no monster gonna come after you, son. You think we scared them off for good this time? May I keep the gun? Place is gone to shit. I ain't been down here in nary a decade. I own a 2,000 acre ranch up at Horny Lake now. I heard on the radio you'd been sighted up near Roswell. I figured you might show up here. I'm in this house with bad memories. So why'd you come? need a place to hide, you need money, well, you're barking up the wrong tree, son. Far too late to come begging now. Ain't nothing you can offer to make up for what you've done to us. I think of my father, I see a fuck you and a fist flying in my face. When'd you ever do right by me? Disobedient, ungrateful, sense like a flat tire and a mouth like a sewer. Oh, I saw where you was headed. I've been down that hole myself. And I guarantee goddamn to you, I did all in my might to pull you out. What more do you want from me? I wanted you to treat me like I mattered. Like I wasn't some piece of dog shit got stuck on your shoe. I did my damnedest with you. The truth is, you were broke beyond fixing. What, are you some sort of super killer terror bomber now? You're on the wrong side, buddy. All them years, I was banging my head into the wall, coming to see that everyone was against me. And when the Nazis took over, things got a lot better. You play by their rules, you can do very well for yourself. Ask anyone around these parts, Blaskowitz is a name of renown and respect. Everything you touch turns to shit, and I do not need your stink on my name. Wanted murderer. Run off to the army as soon as you come of age. Broke your mother's heart. Where is she? She's gone. When? What happened? What happened is we had a big goddamn war, and now we got a new government with new rules. They took her. She's gone. And what's that queer outfit you're wearing? What do you mean they took her? They rounded up all the Jews and the coloreds and the queers. This is a white man's world now. White man's got to keep it Christian. You sold her out. So what? Wife made a living bemoaning me and raised a boy into a murderer. Well, I always saw you for what you are. Ten pounds of shit in a five-pound bag. On your knees. Daddy, I'm 
your side. Down on your fucking knees. There was a time I was scared of you. There was a time I'd have pissed myself and a gun pointed at my head. You know what I feel right now? Not a goddamn thing. We're back. That didn't really surprise me any. That's a shame. Uh-oh. Well, this can't be good. So we earned the trophy R.I.P. Oh, man. Alright, so, uh... Gotta get rid of these claws here. Oh, out of here. Tell you what, I got uh, a little bit lost here. <laughs> once, the, once everything started going sideways on me. Literally. Anyways, check out this awesome shooting. It's like I'm just <laughs> flawlessness. <laughs> Surprised he even hit him once. It's starting to straighten out a little bit. I don't know why I was getting all crazy, but uh, eventually uh, you'll find your way through here. Okay, and you'll have to jump down. There's a uh, there's a lot of ammo and stuff like that, but let me tell you, it can get a little tedious. So I went right for this. Now you don't have to continually breed at it. He'll automatically do that. But, uh... Eventually get here. Make sure you get your uh, laser craft work ready. Because uh, there's a couple heavies. Man, I this took me a while to get through this. Get getting my ass handed to me. But you can see, I don't have like hardly any armor. My health's going way down. All I want to try to do is get to this. Wait, oh, wrong side. But uh, we're coming up on another cutscene, so I'll see you folks in a little bit again. <laughs> Enjoy. all a show. And I'm the guy wearing the black hat. No, 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 uh, no, I said. You will not deny me access to my client. You, you, you just breathe. I am entitled to confer with my client in absolute privacy. You want me to call the judge? You will be looking for another job tomorrow. You hear me? Now you're looking to see my client, or you're going to test me. Oh, what is this? Of him. 
him. Schnell, motherfucker. Oh, come on. How's he supposed to talk to me when he's, when he's got that, that, that gag thing covering his mouth? Not my problem, it's Cezanne. Oh, Christ. Will you just give us some privacy, please? Oh, you look like ass, man. Fuck. Looks like you're at death's door. Seriously, this is not a good look for you. Anyway, listen, uh, your trial's coming up in a couple of weeks, and after that, they're gonna execute you, and that whole charade's gonna be televised to every living room on the planet. So instead of that bullshit going down, we're gonna break you the fuck out of here right now. It's kind of a risky plan, but the security they have around you is out of this world, so it's kind of the only play we got. All right? I mean, the hoops I had to jump through to get to you, and I'm your fucking lawyer. That pissed me off. But, hey, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make like you attacked me, and when the guard pig comes in looking for your ass, I'm going to sneak up behind him, and I'm going to shove this little number right into the base of his skull. I'm going to grab his keys and his gun, and I'm going to roll you right on out to the elevator. <laughs> Pop and Nazis, wherever they show up, straight down the garage, where boom, body and Anya and everyone else has the getaway car. Okay, you ready? Let's get this freak show on the road. <laughs> That hurts so bad. You don't even know. This fucking gang thing off you. All right. Once we hit the street, it's all car chases, flying bullets. They got tanks outside, man. We got some tricks up our sleeve, though. If we make it that far. We make it. The hard part. Is getting down to the garage. Hey! Help! Help! Open the door! He fucking attacked me, man! He broke my nose, and then he got out through that door right there! Fucking terror Billy! He's on the loose! Stay back. And, and, he, and he had help. Uh, they, they came in right through that door, and they broke him out. It was space aliens, man! <laughs> zum Film gehen, bei Helene vorsprechen. Guter Schuss, General. Der zuckt noch. <lacht> Idiot. He was dead as soon as he walked into the building. Tapfer, kleiner Liebling, ich bin dein und du bist mein. Liebling, so lieb. Open your mouth. Open. Open. That's it. Huh? How does it taste? Shh. How does it taste? The gunpowder of the bullet that killed your friend. How does it feel? Do you love the taste? Oh! <laughs> you hear that? It's my attack force. Mm. Moving in on your friends in the garage. You're so far away. I'm gonna go down there now and join in on the fun! Fun? My family. Weeks pass. Or more. Feel myself slipping away. Got me praying for the end. For theft and destruction. Yeah, Alrighty, here we go. Property, aiding the enemy. Torture. Terrorism, including nuclear, both domestic and abroad. Yeah, I've done some pretty horrific things, but look at you bastards. What have you done all this time? 
A hundred thousand times more worse things. Even for a man of my job description to come face to face with true evil. And it pains me that the maximum sentence that I can bestow upon you is something as trivial as death. Death, Mr. Blaskowitz. Nothing but swift, sheer death. <laughs> Bailiff. Okay, here we go. Let's get the show on the road. That's the ticket. All right, so this gets pretty intense. There's a lot of guys here, but if you, if you, uh, you know, pay attention to your surroundings, you should be able to get through here with no problem. Just gotta be careful. And I mean, if you're gonna be this close, you might as well melee, right? Absolutely. And there's plenty of health, plenty of ammo just scattered everywhere. Plus, the more people you kill, of course, um, you're the more armor you're gonna find and stuff like that. And then you get stuff hidden. I, oh, I thought I didn't grab that. <clears throat> and of course, when it's all said and done, don't forget to search around through here. There's some collectibles. Right, get my favorite demo. Some overchargedness. Start blasting away. There's those shock hammer bastards. So some of these doors are locked and everything, but don't worry. We'll get we'll be able to get in there. They'll unlock here shortly. And I do recommend you save often. Now, I don't know if that was... I'm not sure if that was a grenade or... If, I'm pretty sure it was a grenade. I don't think it was one of those... Uh, I don't think it was anything else but that. Oh, man. Yeah, there's a lot of guys here. Oh, he just threw a grenade, but guess what's going to blow up and right in right, his nutsack. That's what you get. There's a guy that looks like a fucking safe on his head. Alrighty. Now, you definitely, definitely want to take advantage of these guns here. Pretty powerful. Now, if you don't zoom in, they shoot, like, like they shoot shortly. Okay. Uh, I mean, like, they'll shoot one at a time. Okay, so see now how fast they're shooting. Now, I'm not sure if there's a difference in, in like, power if you just shoot. Oh, I see. Now I get it. I'm such an idiot. When I'm shooting single shots, I'm shooting shotguns. You know, combat shotgun ammo for shells. When I hold it in, it looks like I'm shooting. Um... No, it doesn't. I don't know if it's a combo gun or not. It seems like I'm shooting like um, the uh, Sturm Gear ammo. Like when I zoom it in. All I know is you want to just, if you can, stay on this mount because see your ammo. You don't deplete your ammo when you're on the mount, just like the. Uh, previous guns in Wolfenstein the new order but once you take it off of there you know and also don't forget these guns are pretty heavy so when you get a chance after you take out a few more of these stupid bastards uh, you know I would I would run and drop I would just drop it and you know, there's a little there's that puppy you gotta shoot the puppy sorry about that but that's what you gotta do or it's gonna chew you it's gonna chew your ass off and we can't have that. Okay. Well there's another there's one of those gas powered gasoline powered guns right there. Wanna use that. I'm just using my favorite gun right here for now. I need, I need some more ammo and health. Uh, oh, there's some Alright, sweet armor. Armor is what I meant. Well, I needed ammo too, but I don't know why the hell that took so many times I had to... Oh, no. There's the, there's a the guy shooting gas, gas bombs at me. So... We're getting there, though. We're almost, uh, we're almost uh, completed here. I mean, uh... Like I said, you definitely want to save often because you got a lot, a lot of people attacking you. And there are a couple heavies, like the guys that have the laser craft weapons. There's also the gas weasel and 
weak-ass wielding, uh, wielding <laughs> gunners. You know, one of these days, maybe before the end of the game, I'll learn the characters, the actual characters' names. You know? Maybe, maybe not. Probably not. <laughs> Although, uh, I did purchase the Season Pass, which I didn't know that I had to, with because I have... This is, I, I bought the special edition, all right. So it came with the terrorability doll. It came with you know all his, all his weapons and stuff like that, um, and the steel case and everything. Well, I would have thought it would have came with the you know with the season pass. Did it? No. So that was another twenty five dollars. So I had to, I did have to get it. So now you know whenever I'm done with the main quest, I am going to play through the DLC as well. So we'll we'll go through that. So we can check that out. Remember that vault countdown? So that's exactly what it was. That's exactly what it was. Well, we are coming to another... Uh, quite a few cutscenes and everything like that. I don't think there's any more fightings. But, uh... You know. That was a good fight. It was uh, pretty long and arduous. Didn't seem that long because I cut it down. But, uh, yeah, let me tell you. It's, uh... Pretty badass. Anyways, we are coming to the end of this video, technically. I mean, I'm, uh, like I said, there are a lot of cutscenes coming up here, and there isn't really much action going on, so I'll leave you guys to it. As usual, this is Scyther477 saying take care and cheers so long. Rate, comment, subscribe. It would mean so much to me, and I really appreciate every single subscription and every single like, and, and if, you know, if you want to comment, and of course, uh, you know, all that stuff, so really, really helps out. But uh, I'm going to shut my trap now so you can watch this and enjoy. All right? We'll see you in the next video, which will be part 10 of Wolfenstein, Wolfenstein 2, The New Colossus. Bye-bye. All hardship is temporary. Do you know this? Most of it is inevitable. I had to stay behind so that you could leave. And now you are the one in trouble? Do not worry for me. My troubles are all for my son. I don't want to go back out there. I can't do this anymore. You are strong, Billy. We are survivors, you and I. We keep fighting even when we do not know how. You cannot help but be my son. <laughs> I'm having twins, Mom. They're not born yet. I want to see them. I wanted you to see them. I miss you. We will be together soon. You just have one more hardship to do.
We would have been so good together. Tony, you're breaking my heart. The old and the weak are doomed. Position. She's dropping it! Here at the Kindle left, we have less than seven seconds. Okay. Ready? Steady, march for button! Drop it! Oh. I'm not, not! Hurry! We have three seconds! We need to give his brain oxygenated blood or it will die. Transport! Ago, Caroline obtained this latest generation biologically engineered super soldier body from a Nazi scientific lab. Very, very impressive specimen. Anil, please show this to him. Look, William, Seth is going to attach this to build the connection between your head and your new body. Anil! Oh, yes. Kindle, please! I'm in love with you. Please come and help me here. Now, these are very rare Nazi combat equipment <laughs> from super soldiers. Our fighters found in the field. None of them is working, but I have enough material to fix one contraption. You should decide which one you want. You can choose. Blink once for this one, blink twice for the one in the middle, blink three times for that over there. Okay, Yingle, let's get to work. I will sedate you now. See you soon.
Set? Set! I'm awake. I'm not asleep. I'm got in you, got in you, got in you, got in you. How you feel me, Mr. Blaskovich? Can you move your body? Yes, you can. Show us. Show us. I feel powerful. Do you remember your name? Do, do you remember your doings in the last two years? Aside from killing Nazis. <laughs> If you die one more time, William, I will murder you. Come, I'll give you some clothes. Send them to me when you're done. No, have you seen Get away? Where's to get in? Where's to get in? Shim Shim. I get the Shim Shim. Mr. Blaskovich. How I look? Like a new man, Nicola. A new man. Oh, I look at you. I'm so happy you're back. Now, this, same thing Shoshana has. This, no, 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 no. This connects your head to your body. Very, very important not to fiddle with this. Now, you might feel some weird tingling sensation. Not to worry. It's normal. But let me know if anything else happens. For example, your head trying to reject your new body. Something like this. prepared the contraption you wanted. Put it on. Let's see what you can do with it. Go on, Mr. Blaskovich, put it on. That's right, Mr. Blaskovich. Now, engage the battle walkers to reach to the top of the wall and climb over. Yes, Shimshin. Now, use the battle walkers to reach up the 